Uh, great to be back here. One of my favorite cities in all of New South Wales. Probably the best hecklers in the entire world. Last time I was here, I said, I was on stage and I went, gay guys love me. And a guy in the front row goes, I don't see it. <laughs> and I'm not gay, but I'm really insecure. Uh, so after the show, I was buying him drinks. <laughs> and I was like, you see it yet? And he's like, no. So then I just f blew him. And, uh, <laughs> and I was like, you see it yet? Uh, uh, no, I'm all for uh, the marriage equality thing here. Come on, Australia, pass that shit. Uh, it's about time. Uh, New Zealand is ahead of you, and uh, that's a first. Uh, <laughs> uh, but I mean, come on, New Zealand has to be for gay marriage. Because have you seen the women over there? <laughs> Fucking ugly. <laughs> Holy shit, I would go gay there too. I mean, I know why they filmed Lord of the Rings there, my God. They didn't even need to cast anyone. They just went to the airport. They're like, here you are, come on. They're just picking up people at baggage claim. There, come on, let's go. And I'm all for gay marriage, but I gotta be honest, I am. I'm for gay marriage. I'm just against gay bachelor parties. Uh, that's where I draw the line. I'm not going to that shit. Uh, but no, but I, I think gays deserve to be married. Uh, but uh, like, if gays, if you're out there, I just wanna say from, from a straight person, what the fuck are you doing? You won. You don't have to get married. We should be fighting for what you have. You're the lucky fuckers. Oh my God. Gay people fighting for gay marriage is like white people during the days of slavery going, I want to pick cotton too. <laughs> let's be honest. Let's be honest. <laughs> Monogamy is a bunch of horse shit. It really is. Come on, I know you're all married. You're looking at me like, no, it, yeah, it sucks. It sucks. It's not fun. It's like fishing in a pond with one fish. <laughs> you're like, oh, 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 look what I caught. Oh, it's you again. All right. All right. See you tomorrow. Uh, oh, there you are again. Oh, oh, great. Oh, this is amazing. Yeehaw. After three days of that, you'd be like, fuck this. I'm going to a fish titty bar. So I am from America. I am uh, the land of the, uh, the land of the Bibles, banjos and assault rifles. Uh, very proud of that. Yeah, that, uh, my country, my God, you're going to see me at Christmas Island soon. I'm trying to get in. Uh, <laughs> I saw it on the cover of your newspaper, some pictures there. It looks like a resort to me. I'll fucking do it. Uh, no, I, I don't understand my country, though. The bi I mean, it's, it's like two-thirds of America born-again Christian. Coincidentally, two-thirds of America gun owners. And I've read the Bible cover to cover. I didn't see anywhere where it said, Thou shalt not kill unless thou on my property, motherfucker. <laughs> and you have to watch the gun debates on TV. It's hysterical. White people don't know how to argue. White people are retarded. Watch the white people on, on, on the debates. They're like, government's never going to take my guns. I'm like, shut up, white people. You got to learn from the black people. They know how to argue. White people are like, government's never going to take my guns. Never, ever, ever. They will have to fight me. It is my constitutional right. They will have to come kill me. They will have to pry my guns out of my cold, dead hands. And I'm like, oh, God, you're morons. Watch the black people. Watch the black people on the news. They're like, guns? No guns here. I didn't see any guns. You see any guns? <laughs> I didn't see any guns.